Welcome to A Wild and Simple Life. Short and cosy stories for grown-ups. A chance for you to relax, slow down and escape. I'm Julianne. I read and write all the stories you hear on A Wild and Simple Life. Thank you for listening and for sharing my stories with anyone you know who likes to embrace simplicity and quiet, simple, wild moments. If you need a little more coziness, comfort and connection, you can head over to awildandsimplelife.com where you can find the full library from the show and special ways you can support me plus connect with me privately. Now, it's time to get comfortable, make a warm drink and get as cosy as you can. This week's short story is called Solitude in a Gloomy Day. It's about finding beauty and solitude in the gloom of a dreary, rainy day. So grab a cosy blanket and a warm drink, sit back, relax, and enjoy this little story. Solitude in a Gloomy Day The air here is filled with the earthy, musty scent of petrichor, a pleasant aroma that occurs when rain falls on dry soil. It smells fresh and rejuvenating. The raindrops gently patter on the roof and windows, accompanied by a chilly breeze and a dark, moody sky, occasionally brightened by a ray of sunshine. There is a certain stillness and tranquility that comes with a dark, cold day, bringing me immense joy and contentment. It feels as if the world momentarily pauses, allowing me to catch my breath and savour the dreary weather. I observe the raindrops racing down the glass, merging before falling onto the earth below. The dull grey sky enhances the vibrant colours of flowers and trees, making them even more beautiful. I take a deep breath and smile as a soft grey light filters into the caravan. I curl up on the couch with a warm cup of tea, a cosy blanket and a book. The sound of the rain hitting the roof creates a melodic rhythm, introducing a feeling of calmness and safety within my own little bubble. The outside world feels distant, leaving me alone with my thoughts. This moment of inner peace and escapism from reality is something I deeply cherish, and I'm truly grateful for the temporary respite from routine that a rainy day brings. When the sun is shining, it's easy to get caught up in the fast pace of daily life. However, when the rain is pouring down, everything seems to slow down allowing me to appreciate the simple pleasures and find inspiration, creativity and joy. The dullness fills me with a cosy feeling and grants me permission to indulge in activities like baking cookies, playing board games with family, reading, writing, napping and lighting candles. It offers a mental break from the stresses of everyday life. Why do I enjoy this connection with dark clouds so much? Perhaps it's because rain has always held significance in human culture and mythology, associated with renewal, fertility and life. The ancient Greeks believed rain was a sign from the gods, and many Aboriginal Dreamtime stories feature rain spirits. Maybe for me, it's more a primal feeling, a connection to the life-giving water that allows all living things to thrive. It represents renewal, a fresh start, and a cleansing of both the physical and spiritual worlds. Whatever the reason, while others may grumble, I smile at the grey skies, and will always find beauty in the gloom. If you enjoyed this little story with me today, comment below 
You may also feel called to share it with someone you care about. I would love that. After all, we can all benefit from and deserve a moment to ourselves to escape and slow down with a very short, simple story. A Wild and Simple Life is a reader and listener supported publication and podcast. To receive new stories and support what I do with ad free listening, consider becoming a free or premium subscriber over at awildandsimplelife.com. Thank you as always for joining me. Sending love. Until next time.